All right, hello there, guys. Um, so I've had a video requested um by someone um about how I did my menu. So I decided to make I'm gonna make a video to show that. Um, so let's get straight into it. You're gonna need um pillow as that's what we're going to be using to import images into a menu. Um, so if you want to just Google how to get that, I'm not going to show that in the video because it's going to waste too much time. Um, but if we start it off, um, swap to the next line. So from TIL, import, image, With a capital site and image TK with a capital T. So those are all we need for this part. Now we're going to make a class. So let's go class menu. Make that our main menu. Oh, we don't really need to. Um, then obviously the normal thing, and then define, and we're going to go menu. Menu, oops, menu create. So this is going to create all the images and spawn them in. So to start with, we're going to go button one. Obviously, I've got um, I've put together a few buttons for you guys uh, just to show you using a website I found online to make buttons. So um, we're going to be using those four buttons there. Um, next we need to go, so we're going to, um, oh hang on a second, next we're going to render those, oh we'll uh, load the button, load the first button, just hang on one second, I'm just using a code that I've used previously to uh, remember the parts that I might have forgotten. So we're going to load in button one. So that's image dot open. Then the brackets with a double um, speech mark. And we're going to go button slash button because we have put it into a file called button within the directory. So if we go back to example, we've got the buttons folder with button in it. Um, and then we have to open up, I don't know why that has both of them. Right. So now we have to load up, uh, is it the part? Yep. So then, uh, and it is a PNG, I think. So we need the file part, or the file part, yep, the PNG. So, get dot .png. Next line. And on this line, we write button, no, oh, one second, oh, okay, yeah, so this is resizing, so button one equals button one dot resize, and this is where you put your resizing uh, things so say 100 by 50 and it will resize it to 100 by 50 and then we go um, image I don't even know how to say this word into alias I'm not sure um, need to go back to here and put in another bracket just to convert that one so then we need to go down to the next line and we go render one and we go equals image t 
T K with a capital K with lowercase a capital T lowercase K um, dot photo image and then we go with button one. Next we go image one equals label brackets brackets then we go canvas because that's what we've named our canvas we go image e image equals render one then we go border width equals zero background equals button color so that's setting it to the color of this variable up here to make sure that all the buttons are the same color and so it doesn't have to you don't have to rewrite the code or fill out the code so next we have to go image one dot image equals render one and then we go image one dot place x equals um, let's say a hundred y equals 500 putting in the thing and then we go image oh no this one doesn't that bit doesn't matter because part of what I did for my so if we run this get this over to here oh we haven't hang on wait we haven't done something oh what happened there okay it seems to have closed it don't know why it did that Okay, so we need to call menu menu dot menu create. As you can see, and then if we run it, hmm, and now comes the bug fixing. search for button and button x oh my days oh sorry i put the wrong directory on it's buttons not button oops that's not right either oh and render was spelt wrong And there you can see it's brought the button onto the canvas. Obviously because I'm loading the canvas on my other screen, it's a bit smaller. Um, so, yeah. Um, but you can make this, um, you can make button change size using the these. Obviously it makes, it makes the button dependent on size and in the next video I'll show that as well as loading in and creating this into a button.